Tonight, St. Louis is wrapping up what's been a very violent year. News 4 has been tracking the rise in homicides. Right now, they stand at 32% more this year than in 2013. Last year, St. Louis police responded to 120 homicides. As of today, there's been 159 homicides. Russell Kinsall spoke with Police Chief Sam Dotson this afternoon about how police will cut the number of murders. He's live at a vigil for homicide victims. Russell? Corey, there were more families invited to that vigil taking place at the church behind me this year than last year. The homicide rate in St. Louis hasn't been this high since 2008. But Chief Dotson did tell me he has a definite plan for reducing the number of lives lost to violent crime next year. With the support of my family, you know, that means my immediate family, my friends, church family, and all, you know, and that helps you get through it. Shirley Douglas has attended the vigil to remember homicide victims since she lost her son, 42 year old Andrew Thompson, to gun violence in 2009. In 2014, the homicide rate was already up by 20% by July. It climbed even higher by the end of December. Why? Chief Dotson said maybe because officers spent less time patrolling streets and more on civil unrest, the Ferguson factor. Criminals, people that go out and commit crimes, my observations have been that felt a little more empowered. Maybe because police are distracted, maybe because they feel a little more empowered. Chief Dotson has asked for 160 new officers to help tackle the rise in homicides and aggravated assaults, but those officers won't be added overnight. By the time you recruit, by the time you train, by the time you go through their rookie stage, so we're at 18 to 24 months before those officers hit the street. Dotson also said because officers won't be in Ferguson next year, he plans more hotspot policing. There are about 13 neighborhoods that account for about 40% of the crime. We know where, where the crime is, we just have to get into it. Since 2006, the overall crime rate in St. Louis is down 50 percent. That means 50 percent fewer victims, but that is no consolation to the families attending the vigil inside. Live in North St. Louis, Russell Kinsall, News 4. And we wanted to know how the number of homicides that have happened in St. Louis stacks up to other areas. Kansas City finished 2014 with the lowest number of homicides in nearly five decades at 76. In St. Louis County, detectives investigated 32 homicides. In Jefferson County, there were three murder investigations. There were zero in St. Charles County.